yo what is up guys welcome back to my channel and it's been an interesting time and an awesome time always coming before you with epic videos with interesting stuff about africa and you know the movements already we are just showing africa in the best way we can if you are new to this channel and you don't know what this channel is all about i just travel around currently i'm traveling around ghana I'm hoping to visit other African countries and any other country also that I might get the opportunity to visit. So I'm just promoting countries, promoting, but basically the, con uh, the concept is about selling Africa to the world, letting uh, the Europeans see what we also have in Africa and the best things we can find in Africa. Just to clear the concept of what the white media have shown about Africa. Okay, so today I'm bringing you a video I shot in the Ashes University titled in my videos as Wakanda on the Hill. Now, before you watch this particular video, do well to watch the Wakanda on the Hill video. It, it will be up here in the card. You can just click on the eye symbol over there. You see the video, click on it, watch it, get a gist or whatever it is about, then come and see the reaction video of it. All right, let's get right into the video. So, um, Wakanda on the Hill is a video I shot about Ashes University just to promote the beauty of the university this is one of the best universities to me I see it in Africa I've not seen any other African country that has one of these best facilities the, the, the students are like you know yeah so I've not really seen any Africa or head of any African country of that sort so to me it's the best university in Africa so far but when it comes to West Africa I can hit my chest on it and say it's the best university in West Africa you know and I sometimes in my own legs I try to term it as the Harvard of Africa but hey wait <laughs> Ashes University don't like to be tagged with Harvard University okay so without much I do let me just react and explain things about this video this particular Wakanda on the Hill video to you okay so let's just jump right into the video all right so guys let's watch the video then let me explain stuff to you Hi. Hi. actually those girls is so uh, wonderful you know one of the things i love about shares investors every student i met on campus like anyone before passing by you is like hello 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 that kind of a thing you know like there's there's nothing like i didn't see anybody being pompous nobody was like yeah hey, hey, i am this i'm no like they were so humble the girls hey nobody should come at me with this okay the girls were so down to earth the guys were so down to earth like i love the school already okay yeah <laughs> Administration block, okay. That's the administration block for Ashes University. Look at look how beautiful the, the building is like, and like the school is on a hill, like it's on a hill. It's in the eastern region of Ghana, Burekusu. I'll leave a website to the school in the description box below, okay. So do want to check out the school. If maybe you want to apply to the school and stuff, so I'll talk more about that at the end of the video. But look at how beautiful the school is like. Let's let's watch it. across any Ghanaian university okay aside that I've not come against any picture of any African university with such an arrangement of uh, a lecture hall look at how they sit like they're sitting to shines and man this 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 hall this lecture hall is serious and looking at the student like anywhere you get to on campus 
there are series of students somewhere at least focused on something they are doing something so you get to see that no this school and actually the school is a liberal school okay they, 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 are, they are not so much into just academics 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 okay they are into practical academics so they teach you then you do the practicality of it then you it's like it becomes part of you as education is supposed to be it becomes part and parcel of you not just go to the class and memorize stuff and go and pour it like chill pour past stuff and like it, it's a great school and this school was founded by mr patrick Iwua, okay he's he, he was formerly a, a, a worker of microsoft okay so he used to work in microsoft he came down to ghana he decided to invest into something but after some thoughts and stuff he decided to start this particular school ashesi university and ashesi literally means beginning when we talk about ashesi it means beginning that's what it means in our local dialects over here it means beginning so this school indeed is a beginning of your future like when you go to this is a beginning of your future let's get more into the video Compromise this beauty, man. Actually, I also have a nice campus. Like my campus is green, 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 like you know, vegetation green, you know. <laughs> All right, so I also have a very nice campus. Okay, like my campus is also very, very beautiful because of the green nature. We have these uh, plants and stuff everywhere, green grasses, very nice, laid flowers and stuff. Very, very awesome. Okay, one day I'll give you a tour of my school. Okay, if you want to see a tour of my school, just let me know in the comment section below. Or let me see. Okay, let me know if you want to see a tour of my school, my campus. Uh, let me know in the description box below and if I get probably 2,000 likes for this particular video I'll give a tour of my school so let's let's continue <laughs> That's a chess, okay? That's a chess over there. I even wonder if they play the chess actually, but it's like if it's a design, it's a nice design, but if they really play it, hey, come on, it's cool. See the beauty over there, like. See, see the view. That was the youngest pilot to me. Uh, that was the youngest pilot. Okay, he's, he's one of the youngest pilots. Or not one of the youngest pilots actually, but he's the youngest pilot ever. I had my name. That was one. Look behind. <laughs> I'm not get, going to be distracted again. Let's continue. Hey guys, do you want to check out Emma Forsen's channel? Like, she's also a YouTuber I met in Ashes Invest. Like, there's no plan, there's no like um, something we plan. I was just shooting, I decided to go down to that side and I found this lady seriously doing some 
magic song your boy like Lenin or whatever it is you doing but I just turned on there and I spoke to her hey are you okay you know actually I just I just didn't take a video of anybody before I make you come into my shot I try to seek your permission so are you okay if you come into my shot if you're okay cool and I just video you into my into my video or whatever you say it <laughs> so I just put you into my video so she gave me the word hey come on we can just shoot it so I was like, okay and eventually she was also a youtuber so do have to check out her channel and support her reasons why you see nine shots in my video is I was very particular I visited a chassis before before going there for this particular video okay and there is this very beautiful uh, nine scene over there so I wanted to actually get the, the midday scene or let's say the late day scene and also get the evening scene as well so I eventually got what you saw from the beginning the midday scene, the late day scene then this is a nice day like the camera might not be able to project it very well, but when you visit a Chelsea University, you see what I'm talking about. It has one of the best, uh, when, when we talk about um, like views, especially when you're on the mountain and you're viewing Accra in the evening. Oh, come on, the light and everything, it, it, it's a sight to behold. Let's continue. <music> Okay, like I said, in a chassis you don't cook. Okay, so they have this cafeteria. You go, you pay. You have a, you, you, they have a card. Okay, so you go and eat over, over there. But there's nothing like cooking on campus. You only cook when you're off campus. But on campus, no cooking. <laughs> this particular place the hive okay why do they call it the hive you know one of the general concepts that I was told by the one who took me through the school was that Ashesi students are very busy okay so they are like the busy bees and you know bees live in the hive so this is the hive so they are high for the bees you see the hive for the bees that's the thing the thing the thing the thing for the bees yeah that Ashesi hive for the bees <laughs> guys like I said earlier I don't take a video of you without your permission no matter where you are like before I, I include you in my shots at least I'll speak to you hey are you okay now if I'm taking a video and you appear in it are you cool with that if you're okay but you know I just nobody was like nee, nee, no 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 like oh, come on I'm cool and then you see the girls and a lot of people they begin to <laughs> position themselves well for the camera again okay, but like Ashanti is, is a great school everybody was super humble to me like I don't know but I don't know to me but Ashanti it's, it's the students are well cultured well disciplined well friendly we have anything like well friendly they are friendly like yeah like yeah yeah <laughs>
the Ashesid Judicial, should I say, uh, office, okay? So in Ashesid, they have the judicial system. And one, at the end of the video, I'll tell you some interesting facts about Ashesid Invest, okay? Hello guys, I'm currently in the library, so I can't talk I'm very, very loud. So I'm currently editing this particular video. Take it out here. You can see it over there. And I just remember I want to tell you, I wanted to tell you something about the judicial system of Ashes University. So in Ashes University, they write exams without indicators, without supervisors. So there is no skill to come also over there. So in this case, this judicial system looks a uh, judicial should, okay system looks at the issue of when a student cheats or stuff they investigate into it and they uh, see the punishment that deserves the student. So whenever you teach in the exam, so your own way to go and tell the uh, whoever is in charge of it that hey, I caught this person cheating. So that kind of a thing. So they are responsible students over there. And in the investors, when you misplace something, there is a place known as a lost and found. So you just take it over there. Then when you find something rather, you just take it over there. So when somebody misplaces something, you know that okay, when I get to this place, I can quickly retrieve my stuff. So. That is an interesting fact about she's in this. Like I said, I'm in a life we can't really talk much. So let's get back into the video. And this is their judicial office. It's not housed by any official judicial big something like they I'm making it sound. But just the students among them they have their judicial system or they are their judicial officials. Okay. Those who uh, look at cases and staffs in their school when it comes to cheating and exams or any any kind of stuff okay so that's the office and the guy over there i mean this particular guy okay he was i asked his permission are you okay if i take a video of this person i was like okay cool he was also okay to come in my show so i just did that for you guys particular place okay it's a very nice place during the day I couldn't I didn't really get it so well in the evening but during the day it's super great hey guys and don't forget to click on my subscribe button like subscribe to the channel like subscribe subscribe like get a subscribe like show, show some love man like show some love subscribe to the channel man. Leave a comment, eh? Film on local nice, do something nice. When I need eh? Film on subscribe. Yeah, we can keep growing, keep sharing the video, supporting, liking, commenting. What I need eh? If you are, if you are for you. Shout out 
to those guys like they are my boys like not like i know them okay but when i entered and i told them the purpose of what i'm doing and they were like oh cool and could you believe i got subscribed these guys just instantly subscribed to my channel and they were so cool and friendly like shout outs to you i didn't take their names they like but shout out to these guys like they are they are real dudes no bye Right, that's a view from Accra, like that's a view, view in Accra, view, Accra, view, okay? And also in our is that they have this should i call it water dispensers okay they have this in most vantage points on campus so they are trying to do away with okay so you just have your bottle in your bag you can just put it under it you just get the water so instead of you trying to buy so much water on campus or spending so much you have this to just help you out that's the school fuel. Mm. It's it's very great during the day. It looks so nice, very big and stuff. And oh man, they they even have this Ashesi. Is it Premier League or so? Yeah, on Twitter. You, so you can check them out on Twitter. Uh, Ashesi Premier League and stuff. <laughs> and those sweet ladies like. They were like, hey, come and do a video, whatever they came to do. And, uh, but I love them so much. Like, they were so friendly. Like I said, as a student, man, they are so humble. Very, very humble. Hey! You're welcome to As you can see, we have a match on Saturday. We are elite girls. Are so shout out to the elite girls. I hope you won your match, though. I hope you won. And that's a sports complex. As she sports complex. Wait a while, that's a gym? A gym? A gym? Like in most campuses in Ghana have uh, gym in their school. So that's a gym in Ashes University. But could you believe this gym is not like other investors you have to register for the gym? Alright, so you can see the guys over there, like you can see the practical stuff they are doing. So in Ashes, you have the hands on practical support. So in Ashes, it becomes part of you, okay? It's it, like I said earlier, it's a liberal uh, school, so you don't just learn the theory of it, you learn the practicality of it also, then it becomes part and parcel of you. Alright, so let's jump right into interesting facts about Ashes University. So, but we are coming to look at some interesting facts about Ashes University. Okay, so like the earlier video, uh, the earlier shots where I spoke about the pilot, he is the youngest pilot in Africa by the name Samor Tori Green. If I'm right, like if I'm writing the pronunciation, okay, so that's his name, Samor Tori Green. That's, I'll leave the name over here in the box. Okay, so. Uh, mode of application to access is just like any other universities okay so you can check out from their website how you can apply just like any other university so check in the description below for the link to the school's website then in access everything is about money like it's money money it's a private school okay so government is not funding them in anything so everything is about money and the fees are way like their fees is going to pay for my four years um, school fees, hall fee. If care is not taken, can I even pay for my masters? Like seriously. And they are school, the uh, foreign foreign students and uh, Ghanaians are paying similar fees. Okay, because I checked it on the website and the fees was the same. Okay, so that's what what you can also get in a chassis and like i said you don't cook when you're on campus so in the cafeteria you 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 have uh there's an estimated budget given to your parents where they have to pay then every day you go for three square meals in a day you can check that also from their website it's also in the link below and also when we 
talk about intentions in Ashesi. Okay, most of the students in Ashesi do their master their internships outside the country, especially in Google and some other big places. Like because I know a couple of Ashesi students who have done their internship and have gone for series of programs internationally from the school. Okay, also the school is. Um, the World Bank has uh, a building on campus where they were uh, doing researches. Uh, they were, it's like a research center, something like that. So, so the World Bank, initially I thought World Bank funds the school, but I realized that no, World Bank didn't fund, but just that through the Danish government, the World Bank builds uh, a, a research center for, I think, is this something green or something, something of that sort? Okay. So uh, you can check that also from the website about that building owned by the World Bank. Now, Ashes University, like I said, is located in West Africa, Ghana, in the eastern region of Ghana, Great So that's Ashes University for like, the school is like, world disciplined school, world cultured. Everybody in the school is very humble, very friendly, and it's one of the best schools you can ever find yourself. And when we talk about employment rate, okay, the number of students who graduate from Ashes the rate of getting employment or starting up, most of them even start up their own business. But in a Chelsea University, to come out and be an, uh, an unemployed graduate, it's really scarce. Very, very scarce. Very, very scarce. Maybe other factors can come in, but it's very, very scarce because most of their students are admitted or <laughs> most of their students are working. So let's say, as compared to other universities, if not if we have 10 people who are to be employed in one university, university A, if 10 people are graduated, let's say um, seven will get employed. Uh, let me say even three will get um, um, three will get employed. When we come to Ashesi, almost nine or eight to nine get employed. Okay, so it, it's a school. Hardly will you go to Ashesi and be unemployed. Even if you are unemployed. Man, there's a school that supports startup businesses. This support if you have an idea, you have a business idea, you can just if you're able to pitch it very well, you get the funds for it and you're good to go. So that's a share investing for you. And I have been your boy, your vlogger every day. This is Edmond. I'm just promoting tourism and businesses in Africa, in Ghana, in every part of the world I'll be able to learn myself with. I'm about to introduce wonderful staffs also to my channel. I'm going to do some food reviews and some interesting stuff, some cultures and stuff. So keep in luck, stay in touch. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button down there. Then click on the notification bell whenever I upload a video. You'll be notified I uploaded a video. And also don't forget to share the video, share my videos also, comment, like, whatever good you want to do with my video just do it and i'm very grateful to every single soul that subscribed to my channel it means a lot to me i've hit the 1k mark and i need to get to the 1 million mark like the next day is 10,000 subscribers do but let's go to the 1 mil you know 1 mil then we, we keep climbing you know that thing you know you know yeah yeah so that's it until then i'll see you another time but don't forget to stay positive be kind to one another don't hurt your friend, like, be kind to one another. Until then, I'll see you another time. It's peace.